welcome to coffee emotions it's money again and it's lacoste match point again so today is the conclusive and final episode of lacoste match point fragrances for men saga so today we are going to give ranking uh, to this perfumes based on various criteria number one would be scent profile which is the lacoste signature style number two is performance number three is complement uh, factor number four is creating emotion which is a core aspect of my channel number five is availability and then you might get a bit surprise as well bronze medal goes to the cost match point uri perfume surprised yes uh, this is the beauty of perfumery so this was released in or launched in 2022 to potentiate the negative aspect longevity issue of Lacoste Match Point ADT, they added some sort of stronger uh, notes uh, like black pepper, cardamom, and patchouli. However, in practical, after introduction, it was found it was not found to be what it was intended. So, in terms of scent profile, uh, it has like uh, opening which is quite similar. Uh, to ADT uh, and it's like giving me Vicks Vaporub vibe. Uh, give me one minute. After this Vicks Vaporub opening, uh, it has dried out uh, mainly cardamom sweet. Later on, it becomes too powdery but slightly sweet, slightly spicy. So, in conclusion, I can say that it has very clean, refreshing green semi-sweet, semi-spicy, semi-citrusy scent profile but uh, it is like more of mature scent profile. In terms of performance it is the weakest link yeah it is was in all three of that all three of this so only three hours maximum longevity projection initially good then deep and down siage initially good then deep and down uh, becomes skin scent and faded away like a petrol yeah so okay so I, I compared I used petrol as a metaphor so please don't mind uh, however I would say that uh, people who like mature smell and doesn't much concern about longevity or CR uh, this is worthy for them yeah, even for youngsters who, who want a sort of a sort of new smell uh, for for their collection, they can look into that. So this is worthy to purchase because it is cheaper and affordable. Yeah. So silver medal goes to Lacoste Match Point EDT, which was released in 2020. Okay, and it's still worthy. Okay, so. Its notes are quite similar to Lacoste Match Point EDP. Uh, there are a few differences in top note. It has pink pepper and grapefruit plus basil. In middle note, clary sage, gentiana, and in base note, cashmere instead of acholi. In scent profile, opening is as similar as EDP. So, in opening, you will get Vicks Vapor Up vibe. Uh, in this, it is more uh, citrusy, green, spicy, and sharper. Uh, however, uh, it is not at all like zingy or cloying or irritating, but rather than it is more of soothing. Uh, after that, it has like in middle note. Uh, it becomes more powdery and at the end you can feel like uh, powdery as well as, well as slight sweet uh, in terms of scent profile i would say this is a very clean smell semi citrus semi sweet powdery masculine less herbal and appealing musk uh, appealing scent so this will not appeal only to the mature vibe like edp it can attract young mind young minds as well so yes it is a better sort of fragrance in compared to in comparison to edp it has 
a little bit more longevity uh, about 3.5 to 4 hours projection in siyaj is almost same there is not much difference uh, might be 10 percent 12 15 percent difference in comparison to edp uh, there are chances of getting compliments with it in initial 30 minutes and i have observed that i have witnessed that and i have experienced that uh, which is the common thing between uh, edp and edt is that they both are suitable for like hot weather means summer or spring okay and uh, they can be used as a daily wear because they are not not at all offensive as such some may seem some people may uh, some some of your colleague why might not like the mature scent of edp but uh, because of lack of crh it, it doesn't matter a lot so definitely it is a routine wear uh, you can wear as an office scent uh, no issue with that uh, you can use it on casual occasion but looking towards both uh, short longevity the activity is healthy activity like running trekking jogging walking hiking or visiting jungle so this time if you use this it will fill the gap of two to three hours and it will be worth spending on that yeah obviously gold medal goes to lacoste match point cologne edt yeah so if we look towards box it is like cosmetically blemish in comparison to this high class boxes however whatever in juice is it is like a hidden gem y yes literally it is like a, a hidden gem uh, i don't know why nobody is promoting this fragrance but it is oh my god sort of fragrance so if you talk about match point line uh, it is unique because it doesn't have a uh, greener scent or predominant greener notes so in terms of notes what brings uniqueness is rhubarb rhubarb brings a magical smell and magical touch okay and at the bottom in base note uh, Ambroxan brings the longevity. So, in conclusion, this is a great scent. If you, if I have to tell or describe this scent profile in one word or one sentence, I would say it is clean, pleasant, unique, and magical smell, which is having a great balance of sweetness, citrus, and powdery ness. In terms of performance, uh, it has much better performance in comparison to his two brothers. It is having minimum four hours of longevity, good CH for initial one hour, good projection for initial one hour, and there is complement factor as well if it has been used in a proper way. Uh, among these three fragrances, this is the only fragrance which has created some sort of emotion in myself so in terms of like creating emotion it is initially worked as an activating sort of fragrance later on it becomes calming and relaxing fragrance because it has a intervowed uh, mature aspect of the perfume as well as unique or modern aspect of the perfume it can be adored by both age group youngsters as well as adult and older adults so age group is not an issue with this particular fragrance uh, just like other two based season is summer and spring uh, i would say that it is definitely can be an office wear daily office wear formal wear uh, and yes based on whatever i have described yeah uh, can it be a signature scent? I would say yes, it can be. Yeah, it can be. It is a worthy to be your signature scent. It is quite cheaper. So, hmm. uh, is it blind buy? Uh, please watch the video which I will link in the description. I will put link in the description. Uh, and if you go through that and if you feel that this scent is for you made for you you can blind buy there's no issue with that 
so yes i hope you have liked uh, this video uh, i i have made like a uh, first impression authenticity check initial impression and full review video for all three of these fragrances so please go and uh, check that i will continue my lacoste saga lacoste war lacoste exploration however your subscription your comment your advice your guidance is required so please 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 subscribe my channel yeah and be happy okay thank you bye bye